292 miles northwest of Dutch Harbor. The Northwestern crew has spent the morning hauling through the first 150 pots. <laughs> and so far, Captain Sig is on the crab. <laughs> We're dead. Averaging over 400 keepers a pot. Hell yeah, they're heavy. <laughs> Like right now, we're getting half full pots, so that's darn good fishing. If Sig can sustain the average through his gear, he could fill his 70,000 pound front tank in just 24 hours. <laughs> Once we get through, we get dialed in, we'll, tr we'll go through the gear one more time, and hopefully we can keep tweaking it to where it just gets better and better. Cold, long, monotonous grind begins. Your first day of fishing is usually the longest, but it's going pretty good today. Do. But we don't have the luxury of uh, nine to five and deciding when we want to work. I mean, you got to pull them when they're there. But the long hours and grueling way of life on the Bering Sea has been a saving grace for deckhand Matt Bradley. He's off the streets and away from the temptation of drugs. It'll be one year sober, and that's probably, I think, the longest he's ever gone. I don't know. Hey, man, it's true. It's the way it is. Matt's been battling addiction for most of his 37 years. Addiction's been a lifelong struggle. Finally admitting I had a problem with doing something about it. It's been going on for the last couple, three years. He's jeopardized his job on the boat more than once. Things that pop up with the court dates and, and troubles at home or stuff in your personal life, you know, that affects everything here. Yeah, I think he knew he was on thin ice there for a while, too. For Matt, Sig and the Northwestern family have always given him, and will always give, a second chance at life. A lot of individuals, a lot of support from my crew, my family. I pulled a surprise drug tests on him at one time, just to get the eyes open. I'm like, Matt, I'm so proud of him, you know? Because I've seen him messed up before, and it sucks for him, you know? It sucks for all of us. It's like being up here right now, I actually miss being at home. You know, when I was on dope, this was the safest place for me. It's gotta be about the dumbest place to be on Earth. But, um, you know, I look forward to going home. There's not so much, there's no pain and misery at home anymore. It's happy, good times. That's the look. That's the Matt Bradley look. I love it. 